Greetings, comrades. Hope this finds you well. Quick shout out to the two Uber comrades supporting this channel, my content partner. Thank you. And Independent Left News. Definitely check out Independent Left News. They are a great resource indeed. So I came across this story as I was scrolling through Twitter earlier today, and it just really, you know, encapsulates the liberal mindset, the, you know, liberal discourse instead of actually trying to institute any type of real substantive structural change. In this case, regarding climate change, they go after this really, you know, low hanging fruit that won't really have any type of substantial impact on climate change at all. And I'm referencing the state of California under Gavin Newsom, they're going to be banning the sale of gas powered lawnmowers and leaf blowers, I believe by 2024. All the while you have all of these massive contradictions going on. So under Gavin Newsom in 2020, I believe he he uh, signed or granted the approval for close to 2,000 more oil and gas drilling permits in the state of California. How many gas-powered lawnmowers and, you know, leaf blowers would you need to, you know, outlaw, get rid of to, you know, make up for the difference for all the fucking carbon, pollution, oil spills, et cetera, air pollution, you know, from that almost 2,000 oil and gas permits that Gavin Newsom approved in 2020, I would say that number would probably be, you know, in the millions, tens of millions, hundreds of millions, maybe even billions to get to that level. Um, but again, this is really the, you know, extent of, you know, liberal uh, solutions to these structural issues like like climate change. It's all, you know, on the individual level when, you know, we know for a fact that 100 companies are responsible for 70% of the greenhouse, you know, emissions in the world probably would have made a lot more sense to, you know, attack, go after them, maybe outlaw oil and gas drilling, fracking right now instead of banning gas and gas and leaf powered, you know, lawnmowers. I mean, Jesus fucking Christ. So not surprising because again, Newsom is an absolute fucking hack. I mean, we saw the story a couple uh, weeks ago. I made the video about how he wouldn't sign into law this bill that would allow farm workers to vote by mail, you know, for forming unions, even though the, you know, farm workers and the farmers workers union was pretty instrumental in their support for, you know, voting no against that recall of him. But, you know, if it's, it's good enough for him to vote by mail to keep his raggedy ass in office, but, you know, it's not good enough for the farm workers. I mean, absolute fucking hack. It's like, you know, Democrats, Republicans aren't, aren't going to save us. We need to, you know, get rid of, um, you know, capitalism. Right. So, um, let me see. Let's go to that lawnmower story first. California ban gas lawnmowers and leaf blowers. Here we go. I'll shut the fuck up. I'll that. Um, so, so here's Newsom again. Then we have that juxtaposition of him signing all these, you know, gas and oil drilling, uh, you know, permits. But so we'll start with this first. Signed a bill on Saturday that moves to ban gas-powered lawn equipment in the state, including lawnmowers and leaf blowers, in effort to, mit, to limit air pollution. Jesus Christ. The bill directs state regulators to stop selling gas-powered equipment as small off-road engines by January 2024. Um, the law also calls for new portable gas-powered generators to be zero emission by 2028. Um, all right, so... According to the Associated Press, there are more than 16.7 million small engines in California, which tops the number of passenger car roads by roughly 3 million. Um, using a gas-powered leaf blower for one hour reportedly causes the same amount of pollution to be emitted into the air as the 2017 Toyota Camry driving from Los Angeles to Denver. Um, so, I mean, in the abstract, obviously, you know, it, it's a good thing to get you know, rid of these, uh, you know, gas powered lawnmowers and, and leaf blowers, which again, shouldn't be having a whole lot of fucking lawn space. If you have a lawn, you have access to it, it should be used to grow food, 
not for ridiculous fucking grass, which serves no fucking purpose, right? So in the abstract, this ban seems like, you know, oh, you know, it's a positive thing. There's 16 million of these gas powered engines in California, three more than actual, you know, vehicles in the state. Okay, but where is that same heat for these huge, massive oil and gas companies that are, you know, polluting the fuck out of the place? And we saw that oil spill last week in hunting Huntington Beach. So juxtapose this with, uh, you know, him. Uh, you know, approving these massive oil and gas, uh, you know, drilling uh, permits. Let's see, where did that go? So many tabs up, so many things to talk about. Here we go. Approvals for new oil and gas wells up in California. This is from the AP from 2020. Uh, despite pushing back against the Trump admin's plan to expand oil extraction in California, the state issued 190% more oil and gas drilling permits in the first six months of 2020 that were improved under Gavin Newsom's first six months in office, two advocacy groups said went. So I even undercounted the number. The agency that oversees oil and gas drilling in California issued 2,691 permits to do, drill new wells or rework existing ones the first half of the year, according to news analysis by state data by Consumer and Watchdog Frack Tracker Alliance. Also found that several months after announcing a crackdown of fracking projects, the state issued 48 new permits for hydraulic fracking. Um, how are the state officials? Uh... <laughs> oh man, Jesus Christ. So, I mean, there fuck, they fucking go approving literally thousands of oil and gas drilling permits uh, while banning, you know, lawnmowers. Just the, the priorities seem a little bit out of whack to me. Um, capitalism is the virus. It equally affects, you know, both Democrat and Republican parties. And this is just a, you know, another example of that, frankly. Let me know what you think of California to ban uh, gas powered lawnmowers and leaf blowers by 2024. Let me know down below. Like the video. If you like the video, subscribe for more content. All power to the people. Peace. Much love.